what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to another reaction of sons of anarchy season three I'm gonna be doing two more episodes today episodes five and six sons of anarchy um episode four ended on not necessarily a cliffhanger but seems like Gemma had a heart attack and as i said before i don't think they're gonna kill off her character at least i'm hoping they don't because we already had a big loss in the first episode of the season that was very unexpected so this is a lot of shit that is being dealt with right now everything that they're dealing with is more emotional you know than anything else you know what i'm saying it's leading to some some hot hot <laughs> you know what i'm saying like this season is dealing with the more emotional sides of the um of the motor club rather than the violent side of the of the motor club so i'm definitely looking forward to seeing what you're going to do from here forward because um if Gemma is hurt abel is missing we don't know what's going to transpire between Jax and Tara because their relationship seems kind of like up in the air right now because of how Jack is seen Jax is seeing things. You know what I mean? Um, in the moment when he's telling her, you know, we need to get away, act like an old lady and stuff, he was way out of pocket, way out of pocket for saying any of that shit. You know what I'm saying? But I understand that is it, everything is just so hot. An emotional high right now it's like everybody is just acting in a way that's just way out of character well except tig tig is just always gonna be tig thinks about his dick first this is what it is <laughs> anyways thank you guys so much make sure you leave a like on the video um if not now i'm well do it now you know a lot of you guys come back for the review and then you hit the like button but do it now because you know these episodes are fire all right i think if my videos get more likes my videos will get sent out more so like if at least 75 percent of the people would like the videos you know what i'm saying like would like it like i know it's only like 100 150 of y'all watching this but if y'all would just hit the like button a lot of a, a lot of you know i think it would bring more traffic towards these shows put it in front of people who are looking for shows to watch and stuff like that so i appreciate y'all nonetheless see you guys for the review all she has to say is two words two words bruh i'm pregnant that's all she has to say. I'm pregnant and it would have been done. Would have been it, it would have been done. It would have been over with. There's no way, because no Jax is not Jax would Jax would have never said what he said. He would have turned back immediately and be like, Are you kidding me right now? You know what I'm saying? Um he has no <laughs> He would have he would have been like Okay, you're my old lady. <laughs> okay. There's no, there's no reason for me to step away now. I can't step away now. I can't force you out now. You're in it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you're in it. You know what I mean? So, in any case, guys. This show is amazingly written. I keep saying that, but it's not an exaggeration, my God. It is not an exaggeration one bit. You know? And... I love the fact that they they take time to 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 plow through the plot. You know what I'm saying? It's like let me see how many how many episodes in this season. Same thirteen, okay. Thirteen episodes for the season, and it, it's just to me. I just feel so bubbly when I watch this show, even though it's a show that kind of you know mesmerize you with violence and you know but the thing about it is this the reason why this is so intriguing is because you're not just seeing a criminal enterprise you're also seeing the emotional stress 
that criminals have to go through it's not necessarily that th they want you to sympathize or empathize with them you know what i'm saying it's more of like you're seeing that even though they're doing all of this bad stuff they're still human they're still people who are there who wants to change but it's like this this endless cycle as i've talked about in i think it was the last review i was talking about this cycle of violence that they go through um it's like they can't get a break every time they're trying to do things better like them in, in, in you know in this episode they made a deal to stop the bloodshed you know what i'm saying because there's more important matters as in getting able back going to belfast and i think there's some crazy stuff that's gonna go down in belfast that i'm not ready for you know what i'm saying i think they're gonna come at maggie a little bit sideways because they think that he's the one that's behind everything but it seems like the charter that's in belfast operates differently from the ira or the army as they call it right um so i think that's the showdown that we're going to see when they get to belfast because um it's good to to have information it looks like i don't know if it started in belfast i wasn't even thinking that maybe they're you know what i'm saying like they have irish blood i wasn't even thinking that um and it seems like is a possibility that they that you know like john teller was how you know he was irish or he was had irish blood not necessarily that he was born there or anything like that but he has irish blood you know what i'm saying so um so yeah man Gemma is okay but i don't like the fact that tara did not tell it, it and, and and it's a recurring thing with her of not of waiting and, and i don't know if it's just a structure of the show where they're waiting on these second conversations to happen between these two to to really get to the bottom of things or to really you know what i'm saying it's like we always got to have that moment where jack leaves and then we come back they have a conversation again and then what we want tara to say happens <laughs> you know what i mean so it's kind of like they're kind of leaving things up in the air which i don't really agree with them doing but it is what they're doing so you just have to accept the fact that they're doing it you know so i'm all for it man i'm loving the series i have no qualms with anything that's going on right now in the series it's so well written and a comprehensive story to follow the flow is extremely good there's nothing you know what i'm saying that happens out of the ordinary that i don't understand or there is some sort of mysterious uh, stuff behind it it's not that type of show and when you realize what type of show you're watching you want you expect that show to go a certain way yes there might be some shock you know some stuff that are done for shock value and stuff like that um i still want to know what's the situation between tig and this guy i don't know what their history is but they obviously have some sort of history where tig has a huge problem with this dude transferring back to the club i think he was there before or tig and him tig was at the club that he was at before i'm thinking maybe um or, or something of the sort so so yeah man stall is just she she is just one of those characters bro it's a it's a like she's in my mind she is a corrupted um you know law enforcement she's corrupted she's she's done things that she know she knows shooting edmund was a was a freaking bad shoot that's why i said like he shot it she shot him in the back <laughs> you know what i'm saying um so it was like <laughs> it was a bad shoot it was a bad shoot so she's trying to get out of that so she framed Gemma because Gemma ended up at the house and killed zobel's daughter right so she framed it because the thing about it is that in a way she, Gemma doesn't have a, a leg to stand on at that point because it was kind of premeditated murder because she went in the house with a gun yes old girl pulled on her first but she still went in there with a gun you know what i'm saying and she followed her 
so it was it, it can be considered premeditated first degree murder so yeah i'm saying so um stall used that to her advantage and you know it's getting crazy now jack seems like you know the deal is gonna go on and and he's gonna become like you know an informant for for stall to protect his mom keep his mom out of jail protect the club and also protect his, you know what i'm saying protect his family and get his son back and all this other stuff so she has to play along do what she can and he's gonna hand the ira on a platter to her so we'll see how that goes in any case guys I appreciate y'all for checking this review out, man. I really do thank y'all. Gratitude is ever enough. So remember to leave a like, leave a comment in the comment section, and I will catch you guys later for some more Sons of Anarchy. Peace.